Well, hello, my brothers and sisters. This is Bishop James Swanson. And I just want to tell you just how uh, grateful I am for the cheerful way in which you have given of your time and your finances, particularly to help our neighbors next door in Alabama and in Louisiana who have been affected so much by the recent uh, rash of disasters, particularly with hurricanes. Um, You've been faithful not only in the giving of your time and your talent, but you've reached across state boundaries to do that. And for that, I am truly, truly grateful. But I also want you to recognize that we have been blessed here in Mississippi this year uh, with the hurricanes. We've not had a, a major hurricane to hit us here in Mississippi. And because of it, um, God has blessed us. And so we need to praise God for that. But let us not forget that Mississippi still needs your prayers, uh, your time, your talent, and your finances. And I want to give you uh, just a kind of synopsis of why. You see, right now, there are 150 open disaster recovery management cases still related to the Columbus tornado, the Pearl River flooding, and Meridian flooding. We had three federally declared disasters alone in 2019. Severe storms, flooding, and tornadoes. We also set a record of 115 tornadoes to hit Mississippi in the year 2019. We have work sites in Columbus, Mississippi, Greenville, and Vicksburg, along with Hattiesburg all resulting from the 2019 storms, and we're serving 15 Mississippi counties. We're still also working to help survivors of the Meridian uh, April 2018 tornadoes. Those are things that we are still working on, and that's why I still need your finances. I need your muscle, your work, and I still need your prayers. Now, here are some other numbers uh, of what has happened this year that may be smaller than a hurricane, but still are, yeah, is impacting the lives of people in our state. Although we were spared from, I said earlier, the major hurricane disasters and damages, we did have some damages from wind and heavy rain uh, and spin off tornadoes from Hurricane Delta, Sally, Laura and Tropical Storm Cristobal. The week of February the 10th, major flooding happened along the Pearl River. The January the 10th and 11th and March 24th, North Mississippi was also hit with tornadoes. We also have 29 counties affected by the April 12th Easter tornadoes. 15 tornadoes ripped through that day killing 14 people. Marion County also experienced tornado damage on April the 19th. And then April the 22nd through the 23rd, we had severe weather during that time as well. Numbers of volunteers also had to cancel coming because of the coronavirus that is ravaging not only our state, but across the nation and the world which means that we lost eight teams and over 80 volunteers that had already planned to come and help us uh, with recovery from all the disasters I just told you about. So what am I saying to you? I'm making a personal invitation for you to sow seeds into this good ground here in Mississippi to help families and communities so that we in Mississippi can be ones who, first of all, express charity right here at home. And to see that, there's a link at the bottom of your screen right now, and I want you to go to that link below uh, and in that comment section to find out how not only can you respond, but also to make contributions. I want you to remember something, too, and that is when you make contributions to disaster response, none of that money goes to administrative overhead. 100% of that money goes directly to disaster response. That's the blessedness of being a part of a United Methodist response, and I hope you will do that. Now, last but not least, I want you to look forward to next year 
and prayerfully consider participating in a Mississippi United Methodist Conference, what we call Building Blitz, that will happen in March. And I want you to be a part of that. I'm going to do my best as a bishop to be a part of that as well, where we go out and we do our best to rebuild uh, in many of the places that have been touched by some of these disasters that we've talked about. And I want you to begin praying about it now. If you can't participate, I want you to pray that God would send forth labors into the vineyard. And so we can do the things that God is calling us to do so that we can be helping our neighbors to recover from all of these disasters. Now, I know you'll do it because you are Mississippi United Methodist and you've always responded when the call is going out. I just need you to step up just a little bit more now so we can do a little bit more. And I know we can do it because you and I belong to a group who practices the power of we. And we can do this under the power and auspices of the Holy Spirit. Your Bishop James Swanson asking you to step up in the midst of these disasters. God bless you.